Yo, what's up, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, there was a brand new Fortnite update, including the Rapid Fire SMG being unvaulted, live event sounds added, and new skins and LTMs in the game file. So stay tuned to find out more about those. So the first thing that we're going to get to are these skins. So as you can see on here is the female Midas skin, finally, after a while. You're going to get a 1,500 V-Bucks, her dual wheel pickaxes, and also a back bling as well. So with that being in the game files, there's also a bunch of other stuff, com cosmetics, emotes. Uh, also, the Haze got a new style, which is two styles, which one is Ori, I think, and then Tough Look. So those are two styles that are kind of goldish. Her back bling also got some styles, and her pickaxes as well. So moving on to the next thing that was in this update, obviously the Rapid Fire SMG got unvaulted, along with the cube making sounds, possibly not the cube, possibly the zero point. Either way, there are sounds in the game files that are basically pointing towards there's going to be a live event, which uh, was leading up to this update, there's most likely not going to be a live event because of how little storyline there was. But recently, we got a bunch of different stuff, including the sounds for the live event, which I'm pretty sure are going to be playing for the live event or possibly leading up to the event. So let's hop into those. So besides those noises you just heard, there's also another theory going around about the event in which it starts with the battle bus exploding. On a loading screen actually shows this, but including with the theory, the theory, having all of us fall into the cube or zero point which would then bring us to the old map. And while I believe that that could possibly happen, I have my doubts because the zero point would not be looking like the way that it is right now if it wasn't going to do something. At least that's what I think personally. That's my theory at least. Uh, because it looks like it's about to explode, which I can show on screen here. It, it does not, it, it wouldn't look like that if it wasn't going to explode or do something out of the ordinary. So, I think that's probably going to be the event rather than this, but there's always theories that could go around and that could possibly be true. Long, because the loading screen wouldn't be there if it wasn't going to explain something. Or if it was just not going to be there just for art, I don't know. Classic could have been fan art, I don't really know. But, uh, let's hop into the next topic. So also with the new update is a bunch of new LTMs, which uh, one is it classic and one is protect the VIP, which is basically like protect the president. So if you don't know what that is, it's uh, the president only gets to use a pistol and you have to protect him by t t taking him everywhere in like a car maybe. And uh, just it's, it's, a, it's really fun. If you've never done it before, you're probably going to want to see it in this LTM. Which is actually kind of cool because uh, YouTubers have already made this video multiple probably times on their YouTube channel. And it's kind of cool to see that they're implementing them as LTMs in the game. So let's go ahead and show you guys what it's going to look like. So as you guys can see on screen, it says suit up, it's time to protect the VIP. In bodyguard, each squad is a VIP. Everyone else is a bodyguard sworn to defend them. If a squad's VIP is eliminated, then the whole squad is out. VIPs are vulnerable. They're marked alt to all enemies and can't pick up weapons. But they aren't helpless either. VIPs spawn with a legendary pistol and a rechargeable reviver grenade. So as you guys in TSN says a classic loot LTM will have vaulted weapons of the first half of chapter one, including pump, not epic, and legendary, which because obviously that was in chapter one. Smoke grenade, boogie bomb, bush, the Miyato sniper, deagle, burst, and scoped AR. By the way, thank you to Hypex for all of these tweets, all of these leaks. I will link his Twitter and his YouTube in the, in the description box below. So I did want to remind everyone about the Laser and Fresh's Super Knockback Tournament, which is actually going to have Fall Damage Vaulted. Um, you're going to get points from Top 50, I think, until Victory Royale. So you're going to have 60 points at the end of it if you do win the game, along with Eliminations being 2 points. And um, 
yeah, it's gonna be really fun because Laser Beam apparently has his own version of the Flintlock Pistol, and fall damage is vaulted once again, like I said, so you can't dive to fall damage. Um, it's gonna be super fun. Also, you're gonna be only able to get the Super Flintlock Pistol, which is Laser Beam thing, in high drops. And also, this is a duo stream, so if you have a buddy and you can play with him, then you can obviously play with him like this. Um, there's not much stuff that came in this update besides that and the rapid fire videos, which is gonna happen later on in the video. Uh, so besides that, if you guys did enjoy, make sure to hit the like button, subscribe if you want to see more of these videos on update days. Obviously, the new season, I'm obviously gonna be streaming that. The live event, I'm gonna be streaming that. But like during these update type things uh, that are just content that I can post the, the new skins all the different stuff like that i wanted to know if you guys wanted me to do that or if you wanted me to do something else so enjoy the rest of the video thanks for watching and peace